Hello everyone, this is Rick, and we are here to talk today. So this will be an intro video to my channel, um, actually basically just entering into the new community. If you guys look at my channel, my videos, my channel, I'm going to try to keep my head down. <laughs> um, you guys will see that I actually was, I actually started posting videos years ago, back in 2009. And back then I was part of what was, what is called a weight loss, sort of the YouTube weight loss community. And at the time I was into fitness and like trying to lose weight, eat healthy. We had a big community, you know, joined together, supported each other, had challenges for each other, all that kind of stuff. If you guys are interested in that, by all means, go check out my video on my channel. Um, there's a bunch of playlists on my channel with different styles of videos um, that I created back then. I have posted those videos in quite a few years. And there's a lot of interest in those videos from you guys, and you guys really, really want to see those. I might start recording my workouts again. Um, I haven't worked out lately, so maybe it'll give me motivation to go back and work out. We'll see what happens. Um, I have no plans on doing that at the moment, but if the, if the need and the want is there, I'll get back into it. That's fine. But this time around, I'm entering into a different, I guess, community you can say um, on YouTube here, and that is the gaming community. So I'm going to be posting videos that are gaming related, right? So Let's Play style videos where I'm commentary with my webcam while playing the game. I'm going to be playing different types of games, um, for example, N64, old N64 games, um, and Pokemon to be one of the big things on my channel. Um, the reason is because the guys that are watching on YouTube, for example, Game Boy Luke, Shitty Pega, Nicky Nappy, those are the three channels that I was watching that got me into deciding to do YouTube. I started watching them, which led me to a couple other channels, and I noticed how well people how much people, how much these YouTubers enjoy doing what they do. You can just see it, that they actually enjoy doing what they do. Even with all the editing and the hours they had to put in, they enjoyed it. And I felt like, I felt like I could enjoy it too. And over the last couple months of testing and recording and editing, I realized that I actually do kind of enjoy it. It's, it's fun to do. So that's why I decided to kind of start doing this. I'm going to be focusing my games on games that are playable on the Nintendo system. And this is just because I've always been a Nintendo guy. I've, I own the N64, GameCube, Wii, everything did the Wii U. I had the original Game Boy, I had the Game Boy Color, the Game Boy Advance, the Nintendo DS, and the Nintendo 3DS. I do not have a Switch yet, but I do plan on getting one at some point. So for that, I'm just going to stick to the Nintendo systems. Any games playing on the Nintendo system, I'm willing to play on my channel. Um, I'm going to be starting off in N64 games, and the reason is because of that's kind of where I started. Um, that's how I got. I'm really into RPG games, and the Nintendo 64 kind of got me into that. For example, my first big RPG game that I actually played on a regular basis and beat, I should say, was Banjo Kazooie, which is the first series on my channel starting tomorrow. Um, tomorrow, which would be Monday, July 2nd, is when I will be posting the first video of my series, which is Banjo Kazooie. I'm going to be playing the original game with commentary and everything. So, um, that whole series, as I mentioned in the, in the series, is already been recorded and edited and ready to upload. I haven't uploaded any videos yet, but it's ready to. In the process of recording um, Banjo Kazooie, I have noticed and realized, and I kind of knew this beforehand. I realized I'm not quite, I guess you'd say, confident enough or ready to let everybody know as to my plans on posting videos to YouTube. And I've realized that because there was a couple times while doing test videos before I recorded my actual series. I was doing some test videos to make sure I could figure out how to do audio and video and record it correctly. So while doing that, there were some videos I was in the middle of recording and my roommate and his girlfriend walked in to the house not into the room here, just into the house in general, heard them, and I immediately stopped. Immediately stopped what I was doing, and just went silent because I didn't want them to know I was in here recording these things. Which is weird because I actually told my roommate that I was going to be doing this um, a few months ago when I first got my computer. Um, I decided, I told him, like, I'm going to be posting videos to YouTube, he even subscribed to my channel, so I don't know why I'm exactly think, feeling that way, but I'm still struggling with it. Um, for example, today I got a few videos recorded and a couple of videos edited today solely because I knew that he wasn't going to be here today. I knew that he was gone for the day, possibly even gone for the weekend. He's not quite certain if he's going to be coming back. But anyways, besides that, he's I knew he was gone, so I knew I could record 
a bunch of videos and not worry about it. Editing videos, I'm not worried about because I don't have anything playing, at least through the whole thing through my headphones. All they maybe hear is clicking the mouse <laughs> and the keyboard. Um, so I'm not worried about editing. I can do editing fine with them around, not a problem. I guess you can say it's more like the lack of confidence that I have um, at the moment in myself. Um, and that's kind of what I'm doing this for. I'm not really much of a social person. Um, I've noticed in the last few years. When I'm in a group, for example, like with my friends, my coworkers, whatever, I'm kind of just sitting there silent, um, watching everybody else, listening to everybody else talk, watching everybody else have fun. I'm not saying I don't have fun. I do kind of enjoy just being around people, but at the same time, I wish that I was able to communicate with them better. And I have a really hard time starting those conversations and keeping those conversations going. I always struggle with trying to figure out what to say, worried about you know offending the person, worried about saying the wrong thing, something they don't want to talk about, making them uncomfortable. It's just a bunch of things like that. Um, what has what keeps me going and keeps me yes I don't do that too much, but what keeps me wanting to try is just a little model that I just kind of kept for myself. And that's always to be awesome. <laughs> it sounds funny, but it is. It's just, I just tell myself, just always be awesome. It doesn't matter what people think exactly, just be awesome. And it, it honestly helps. I do not know why, but it does. Yes, again, like I said, again, I'm, I'm still not able to start those conversations or keep those conversations going, but just that thought gets me, gets me going to work. It gets me going out, and at least just being out. You know, if my friends invite me out, I go out with them because of that. There have been times where I haven't been feeling that way. I haven't been feeling awesome, like I want to be, and I will turn down the invitation to go out. I'll just say, no, I'm not interested, or I wouldn't say I'm not interested, I would say I'm not feeling well, you know, I'm not really wanting to go out, or sometimes I'll just ignore. I'll just ignore the message. Um, you know, I know it sucks and that's not a good idea to do, but that's just what happens sometimes. And so I just have to keep that mindset of always be awesome. And it helps. It truly helps. You know, just tell us I just have to tell myself, always be awesome. And it lets me go out. It makes it lets me it allows myself to go out to do stuff. It's a start and I'm working on it. I just can't quite figure out exactly how to go any further. But anyways. I don't want to bore you guys with all that stuff. Um, you know, I'm happy to talk about that in a separate video if you guys really want to. But for now, I'm not going to be doing that <laughs> in this particular video. I um, just wanted to bring that up a little bit. Hopefully, you guys enjoy my, my content and my videos that I have posted, um, that I will be posting, videos I've already set up. Um, I'm having a, my schedule on my channel is going to be, uh, right now, what's going to be set up to be? It's going to be an N64 game, or I should say a console game. For now, it's just N64 games for the first little bit. So I'm going to start with the eventual add-in GameCube, Wii, and eventually the Switch. Don't quite know exactly when. I'll have to figure that one out. But what it's going to be is going to have a console game on Mondays and Thursdays, twice a week. Um, a handheld game, for example, Pokemon, Golden Sun, Breath of Fire, that type of games on the Game Boy Advance and Nintendo DS. Those will be posted on Tuesdays and Fridays. So again, twice a week. Uh, Wednesdays, I won't have any videos. I'm going to save, keep Wednesdays open for videos like this. If you guys have anything you guys want me to vlog about, just sit here and talk about it. If I ever feel like I just need to talk about something, I will save that and post those on Wednesdays. Um, Saturdays, I'm going to have what I'm calling the one-off videos. So, for example, there are little videos that don't really have a storyline to them. So I can just do a random video, post it on my channel once a week, every Saturday, and not have to worry about being like a continuous storyline. So, for example, games that will be included in there, are Mario Kart, Diddy Kong Racing, Pokemon Stadium, and games like that. Kind of just little games like that. So that's gonna be on. That's gonna be on Saturdays. Sundays for now are gonna be stayed open. Um, I'm not gonna post any videos on Sundays. I do have plans to post videos on Sundays in the future, but I'm not quite ready to do that just yet. So hope you guys are willing to check out my channel, see what my videos are like. Hope you guys enjoy my videos. Always let me know in the comment section any video what you guys thought. Anything you guys want to see in the future, and just let me know how you how I feel. Okay? So that's all I'm gonna say for today's video. Hope you guys have a fantastic day, and don't forget, always be awesome.